peace, peace, peace. Love, like, hello to everybody there. Hope you're having a woodland day. Wins your comedy goals, with your tier goals, and with your tech goals. And if you're new to the channel and you want to learn about calisthenics, use your body with the workout, motivation, raise your content, raise your vibration, hit the subscribe button and hit that notification bell on the side so you don't miss a video. That's all I say. What is shine here? I hear probably how to stay and put my job in my way. So, with further ado, we're straight into the video. We've been taking care of ourselves, been focusing on ourselves. And yeah, it's about to be August, bro. It's our year almost over with. You're on over it already. Okay. But anyways, I didn't want to this video is about the sugar to getting abs and it's not working them out. So I'm gonna you a couple secrets. First secret is fasting. Fasting really gets your abs like boom. Fasting because you're not eating nothing, so your your sit your uh, the food got more more time to break down, they got more time to digest. Because when people don't got abs, it's because they got too much fat, they got too much over, over uh, they got too much too much fat, like too much over over they too they too oh, they overweight that's what they overweight they put too much extra meat down there too much extra weight down there so now they fat now they add not showing because everybody have abs but you just gotta let them show them you gotta work them out you just gotta get you just gotta put in the work put them in the show right let's look at my abs see you haven't eaten another day I'm fasting it's like I got my watch but it's, it's one o'clock and I still haven't ate I eat when the sun is the most highest point and that's twelve to like three o'clock so that's when you want to eat because they'll food on they just faster. So, you do that, it's easy. Another thing I want to tell y'all, another thing, when you work out, don't eat before you work out. Or don't eat while you got a full stomach because when you work out, say you working on your ass. I'm just gonna talk about ass. When you working on your ass, right? And yo, you got a lot of food on there. When you working out, you working out that food. You're not really working on your abs. You're working on the food you just digest. So now, you're not getting no type of ad workout. You're just working on all that food you just digest. So now, you, so now it feel like you, you really just wasted a workout because you're not working out nothing. You just working out all that food, so when you when you when you don't have nothing in your stomach, now you working out the abs. Now you got now you now the abs got to eat off the extra fats that's in your muscle. So now that much on top of the extra fat, they gonna be gone. And now your abs gonna show more. You feel what I'm talking about? So don't eat nothing when you trying to work before you work out because you are gonna be working all that food off. You're not gonna be actually working on your body, getting your body more more dense, more in shape. You just gonna work all that food you just ate. So it's really, it's really like a pointless workout because you could just. Not eating nothing and you're working your muscles, and your muscle eat the extra fiber, the extra nutrients in your body you already have to build that muscle, to, to break down that muscle. Just like that. That's the second way for real. Why people don't have. Another way is people don't breathe right. What I mean by that is you ever see the mouth breathers, or people that breathe with their shoulders. I know you put to breathe with your stomach, bro. So let me show you how to breathe. I got a lot of videos in this, but I tell this all the time. But so when you breathe in, your stomach go out. Like that. This is how you supposed to breathe. You at, you ever see a baby when they breathe in, they stomach go up? Like this how you breathe, because they natural, they natural with it. Hey, babies, they babies gonna always have natural things. They always gonna be natural before we program it to do this, do that. So baby, if you wanna know how to live life for real, look at a baby. They gonna teach you everything you need to know. So yeah, that's how you breathe. And you do breathing breathing techniques, stuff like that. I do a couple breathing techniques, but breathing really gets you out there too though, because now you're working on that breath work, you're working on that cheek in your body. So now that cheek flowing around, you get a difference about your body. And breathing in general is a good thing. And now you you, you getting your solar plate chakra in shape now. You, you getting the uh, you you opening it more, you you closing it more if it's too open, you just getting it, you balancing it. That's what you basically doing. So yeah, you see my abs? Best thing to do is fast for real. And you can do ab workouts, but another thing you can do is cardio for real. You really don't have to do you can walk for real. You always walking somewhere, you always active. They help you get your abs right too. You don't have to do ad workouts to get abs. You do, you do ad workouts to strengthen your abs, not to not to get make get your abs there. You already have abs. You already have them. Trust me. You have them. under all that fat, you have abs. Under all that fat too. Stop eating so stop eating. <laughs> stop eating so much. Stop eating so much. And then you make you make you make it get some abs. Simple. You see my jungle always pop. I really I haven't did ad workouts. I did some a couple days ago, but I don't have to do ad workouts for real. I watch what I eat, I fast, and I do what I just told y'all. But that's another thing I'm gonna talk about. Working out, working out, you got food in your system. I'm gonna do that for the whole other video, but I'm gonna break it down piece by piece. So, yeah, like I said, you can fast, work out when you have an empty stomach, because that really helps you work out when you have an empty stomach. And uh, that's if you wanna work out, but. And yeah, do red breathing technique. Breathing technique, cardio. You don't have to do, you don't have to physically do at workouts. 
career. You just walk, like I said, you will walk without a um, with ball fast and you can get out. You really just trying to get that body percentage low. And that's all you gotta do. And you can take supplements. If you're into that type of stuff, me personally, I'm more natural. I don't take any type of supplements. I don't even take protein for real. I take natural stuff, sea moss, stuff that come from Earth. Come on now, that's all I take. That's why I'm this big. If I'm like this at my age, not. Cause I don't really get that much calcium in my in my uh, bones either. Calcium it, it really gets out. It really blows. It really packs on weight for real. Calcium stuff like that. So yeah, I see. I'm out here, man. But yeah, really do breathing technique. I got breathing technique. I'm gonna I'm gonna post it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna uh, actually I'm gonna put the link in the description. Do the breathing technique. Breathing technique really help too. You know how they do vacuums. That help too. Vacuum. Y'all know what that is. I'm gonna get demonstrate like this. That's a vacuum. You just suck in your stomach in. That really gets you ass for real too. I do those sometimes. Like I really, I dare, I really don't work on ass. If I want to work on ass. I just, it's just to get them stronger. That's it. So I can do better movements, harder exercise. That's it. I don't do abs. I don't do ab work to get abs. Like you ab work to get them, get them stronger. That people don't know. You don't do ab work to get abs. You do ab workouts to make your abs stronger. Simple. So hope the video helped y'all. Yeah. Let me know what y'all think. Let me know what y'all think. These tips really help because. Like I said, I don't work on ass no more like that. When I do, I do I do a lot at once, then I stop. And that's it. I might do 500 crunches tonight, that's it. Because when I come my abs, my abs always been strong, so we probably don't have to do nothing. My abs always been strong, because I never had been overweight. I never had too much weight on me, no nothing. I always put on, well, okay, always just like that. You can say my genetics, but I, I don't use genetics as an excuse for that. People use genetics as an excuse, I don't do that. I'll stop using your genetics as an excuse and really get to work, for real. Get down to business. Simple. So, yeah, I hope this video helped y'all. Uh, don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, share the video, talk, help and inspire more people, more people come to my time and see who, and, see, and ch might change their lives. So, yeah. So, I got for that today, man. As I say, Murray Shine here. I'm here prepping another day. If you do my job, man, the way. Peace.